What's going on with all my billionaires out there? This the guy, Hoods Billionaire. Welcome to Hoods Billionaire TV. Big favor, big abundance. On today's episode, we're going to be talking about the LSU and Iowa uh, women's basketball game and Angel Reese and Kaitlyn Clark and the uh, quote unquote taunting that they said Angel Reese did. Let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. So, first and foremost, I in I you know I'm an avid sports watcher. I love sports, uh, basketball, football, baseball. Those are my main three that I really watch the most. Boxing, I take that back. Boxing probably up in there over baseball, um, but are just as high. Those four, you feel what I'm saying? I'm always pretty much up to date on shit that's going on with those sports. You feel what I'm saying? But women's basketball like this was a great year for women's basketball like i'm not even gonna lie you know what i'm saying like it's been a pretty 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 big year for women's basketball especially women's college basketball like the ncaa tournament has been very really since last year you know what i'm saying but the tournament this year has been like epic you feel what i'm saying it's been epic and you can tell a lot of these young ladies are really balling like they really can hoop they some hoopers you know what i'm saying we're gonna give love and respect to caitlin clark she's a baller point blank period like she's a baller like if you want me to just be real and speak on what's real caitlin clark was the best player on the floor last night you feel what i'm saying like she's the best player period in the tournament she's the best player period it's not even up for debate just me being real just didn't have the best team the best team was lsu and they all all of them they played so together they chemistry together you just could see it all of them you feel what i'm saying so hats off the lsu hats off the kaylin clark now the situation with the you can't see me shit first off i know a lot of people ain't play sports like i can tell shit talking and damn near every sport happens bro what do you, I mean, I've never played no sport where shit talking wasn't a part of it. Like, you're gonna talk shit. It happens. It's just a part of sports. It's just a part of sports. Everybody not Kawhi Leonard. You feel what I'm saying? Most, most motherfuckers be talking shit. Whether it's in a subtle way or overt way, most motherfuckers talk shit, bro. Most of them do. Caitlin Clark talking shit, doing hand gestures. Andrew Reese talking shit, doing hand gestures. Yeah, that's the game. Y'all might not like it because they female and they doing it. But I love it. It's sports. It's competition. What the fuck? We finna be mad at talking shit in basketball? That's crazy. Niggas in the NBA be doing the YouTube small. Dunking on niggas. Looking at them. Flexing. You're crazy. Like, that niggas jarred each other all game. Football, even crazier. You listening to some of them uh when they be mic'd up, bro. They be talking big shit like come on now but i do see the i do see the double standard you feel what i'm saying like let's be real caitlin clark did the exact same thing was talking shit waving motherfuckers off you can't shoot you can't see me you know she was hot she in her bag she's supposed to talk shit she's supposed to talk her shit she was handling her business bro i could see if she was talking shit and she wasn't good like she hooping she talking shit she had the right to talk shit angel reese been hooping a double double machine balled out she got the right to talk her shit give a fuck like that's come on now y'all just making something out of nothing but i do love what she said in the press conference i'm doing this for little girls like me you feel what i'm saying who don't fit the mold you know what i'm saying that the the box they want to put you in you know what i'm saying because she a little ghetto girl who 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 is proud of of who she is and the culture that she was reared in you know what i'm saying and that's really the whole hoods being there stable bro like like i'm a product of that i love that i feel like nip was a big part of like pushing that forward you feel what i'm saying you can be an intelligent articulate well-versed black man but still embrace the culture that you were birthed in don't mean that you can't conduct business on the highest level don't mean you ignorant don't mean you not you you can't articulate your words and your thoughts you feel what i'm saying none it don't mean none of that it literally doesn't you feel what i'm saying i'm embrace the culture that i was reared in 
people that live in France embrace the culture they were in. People in Brazil embrace the culture they in. People in Italy embrace the culture that they come up in. You feel what I'm saying? Are there criminal elements to all of those different cultures that I name? Absolutely. Ours just get publicized more in the United States because there's a certain narrative that gets painted on black people. Even though we not the savages and the killers if you go look through history. But that's another YouTube video. You see what I'm saying? But it's just like this the culture that I embrace. This is how we were reared. African American people have have created their own culture and obviously it's infectious because the whole world want to be like us you feel what i'm saying so why wouldn't she embrace that i love that she out there with her lashes on with her makeup on with her nails done you feel what i'm saying i love all that you know what i'm saying talking how she talked doing tiktok videos listening to music that she like to listen to I, I fuck with all of that they tatted they doing they thing they they wearing weave they I love all that. I love all that. Bring that feminine energy to to bas to women's basketball. Bring that feminine energy to women's basketball. I love that. Like so, all that shit gotta stop. That's just some hate. If y'all throwing that at her, that's just some hate because y'all wanted Kaylin Clark to have that storybook in it. It just ain't go like that. Angel Reese, she was she she got her scholarship in Maryland as the number two player in the fucking country, bro. Like she a hooper. Y'all saw it. She can ball. She's a baller. You feel what I'm saying? Like, but allow her to be her too. You know what I'm saying? I ain't really even got much else to say about that because it's just silly to even speak on. But I, I respect what she said because that's real. You feel what I'm saying? And she did. And she did do it for a lot of little young black girls because they going to come up being able to be themselves. You feel what I'm saying? Uh, her, the the Shakara, um, what's her girl? The track star, Shakara. All of them. I love that. Y'all keep that up. Y'all keep bringing that to sports. They can try to keep hating on y'all and pushing y'all back and doing whatever. Y'all keep being unapologetically y'all. You feel what I'm saying? This the God Hoods being there. Big favor, big abundance. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Like, share, subscribe. This the God Hoods being there. Big favor, big abundance. I'm gone.